and Governor Sisolak taking the podium here twice today. His message is clear. First, that we will be able to get through this. And second, it's important now for folks to take the proper steps to keep themselves and their families safe. Nevada Governor Steve Sisolak says the actions being taken now could not wait another day, saying that the Silver State does not have enough coronavirus test kits to meet demand. As a result, we don't know the full extent of what we're dealing with. And so Sisolak declaring all Nevada K-12 schools will close Monday and will remain that way until at least April 6th. This is not an extended spring break. Luckily, teachers and staff are budgeted to still be paid. Now, for parents relying on school lunches to feed their kids, the Department of Agriculture is working with the district to still make that happen. Our children who rely on these programs will not go hungry during this closure. Sisolak also ordering the closure of state offices to the public as soon as possible. I'm directing agency leadership to wind down in-person public services and transmission as much of the work as possible to online and over the phone services. Following that, the governor also issuing a directive that companies should encourage employees to work from home to limit any possible spread. While it may, may not be an ideal situation, it is preferable to having employees unnecessarily spreading the disease at work. Sisolak getting emotional himself, describing this emergency as an unprecedented circumstance. Please take care of each other and take care of yourselves. Together, we will get through this challenging time. Austin Carter, 13 Action News.